One of the best drills that I can give you to practice to get this ball out of the bunker is the hitting the line drill. So we take a line and we draw it in behind the golf ball and it will be around about two inches behind the back of the ball. And then simply just start at one end of the line, making your swing and hitting down the line. Now the line ideally would be around about the front portion of my stance. So it's not exactly in the middle of my stance, it's set slightly ahead of my stance opening my club face, nice wide and slightly open stance, and then I'm making swings where I'm trying to get the club to impact the front portion of the line. If I lean back too much, I hit behind the line. That's probably gonna result in a fat shot where the ball won't come out very far. If I make a swing and don't get to the line at all, then I'm probably not getting low enough on the golf ball. I might leave the ball in the bunker. If I can hit the line nicely, the ball should splash out of the bunker and be quite a successful shot. If we then bring that round to a golf ball here, there's my line. And remember, you're not allowed to do that in a, in a match or in a competition. You can't touch the sand before you play the shot. But in this scenario, we can draw that line in and then we can hopefully make a good solid swing and striking the line again. And then we can play the ball out quite nicely. And it also gives me some great feedback that when I look back down, I can see the club hit the line really nicely. If the ball has then gone too far, potentially I had too big a swing. If the ball has come out and gone too short, maybe my swing wasn't long enough, but I did the right thing by hitting the line in the right place. So next time you're in the bunker, draw a line in the sand, walk your way down the line, hitting that good divot and impact position. And hopefully that will help improve your bunker shots.